What is going on guys, The Griffin22 here and today I'm back with another reaction video. We're, today we're going to be watching the uh, Top 10 Chris Jericho's Greatest Catchphrases by uh, Wrestling Flashback. I'm going to leave the original link in the description below, check it out if you're interested. And uh, go throw them a subscribe, like on the video, you know, just support. And uh, yeah, like, subscribe, like, comment, subscribe on this video as well if you want to see more similar content. And um... We'll preface this, preface this by saying I'm going to enjoy this video because Chris Jericho is probably a, in, my, in my top five for sure. I think he's like number three, I'd say. Because in my top five, I got like Stone Cold at one, Randy Orton at two, and I think I'd put Chris Jericho at three, to be honest. At four and five, you know, I'd kind of like put like Edge, Rock, and Seth Rollins, and maybe in those like somewhere in between there I don't know who I'd change it out for who but you know anyways I'll enjoy this video a lot and yeah um you just made the list was one of my favorites I think right before or right after that like the never like ever ever like that was fun um there was a couple other I just can't remember them it's been so long since like cuz Chris has been over at AEW for a while right but anyways let's get into it well renowned for his ability to reinvent and freshen up his character whenever the time is right yeah. throughout his numerous Very good personas Chris has come up with countless different There's the list Today, we'll look back at some of the best of Jericho as we count down his top 10 catchphrases. First, we'll run through some honorable mentions. When attempting his signature cocky pin, Y2J could usually be heard shouting, Come on, baby. Over that Come time, on, Jericho's baby. been... Come on, baby! Come on, baby! Come on, baby! At <laughs> WrestleMania, the tear could use that silly scarf to wipe his, wipe his cheek. Jericho continued running his <laughs> mouth even when he was wrestling. It was common to see him yell, ask him to the referee whenever Chris had his opponent in a submission. <laughs> Jericho got rid of all his gimmicks and iconic sayings during his 2008 to 2010 heel run. Chris instead developed two catchphrases that fit his new character incredibly well. Do you understand what I'm saying to you right now? Do you understand what I'm saying to you right now? Do you understand what I'm saying to you right now? Do you understand what I'm saying to you right now? Yeah, we get it. When Jericho said, I'm the best in the world at what I do, it got under the fan's skin and was made worse by the fact that Chris could back up this statement. I am the best in the yeah, world. Yeah, I love that. At what I, I am do. the best in the best world in at, the world what world at what I do. Have you forgotten that I'm the best in the world at what I do? Huh? Yeah, because him and that CM Punk feud was Jericho good. Sure I enjoyed that a lot. Is a stupid pity. It. You better watch it. Watch what? It. It. I said you better watch it. <laughs> watch what? It. it. Before we get into the list, this video is kindly sponsored by a little known okay, game let's, uh, doing the rounds on YouTube. Raid. Now on to the Go list. There. Number 10, the Ayatollah, the Ayatollah of Rock and Roller. The Ayatollah of Rock and Roller. Y2J would remind us of his exploits in the music I forgot industry about that. by referring to himself but as the Ayatollah yeah. of Rock and Roller. The Ayatollah when he came back. of Rock and Roller. The Ayatollah of Rock and Roller. The Ayatollah of Rock and Roller. The Ayatollah yeah. This uh, of catchphrase... And bowling. Yeah, this catchphrase didn't hit me as hard until I realized he was actually in a rock group, uh, like Fozzie. Then that that hit me a bit harder because it was good. Because I actually like some of uh, Fozzie's songs, like a couple of them. Not definitely not all of them, but there's a couple of them. I was like, that's some that's some good music right there, right? Number nine, will you please shut the hell up? When Jericho had heard enough, he would politely demand that the person speaking shut the hell up. Please shut the hell up! Would you please shut the hell up? Would you please shut 
the hell up! Would you please shut the hell up? And he kept that for a while. From way back in the day, all the way to now. Pronouncing wrestlers' names wrong when it came to Jericho's opponents, if he wasn't calling them Junior or Ass Clowns, he'd usually be mispronouncing their names. Let's see what you got there, Quasi Juice. First of all, Gene Mean, Skiavon, and Stinko Malenko, Stinko, and Kirk Angel. But seriously, Edgeward, Mitchell Cole, Blazin, <laughs> would you please shut the hell up? <laughs> <laughs> San Tokyo. What does the Big E stand for? Big Easter Bunny? Big Elephant? Big Edward? Big Utah? Big Urkel? Fan Dumbo. Fan Dangler. Fan Dingo like my baby O. Fan B I N G. Number seven, the gift of Jericho. Drink it in, man. Drink it in, Jericho's 2016-17 run spawned some of his most memorable catchphrases, including yeah, when Chris told us to drink in the gift of Jericho. The gift of Jericho. Drink it in, man. Gift drink it in, man. Of Jericho. Drink it in, man. 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 <laughs> it's so like awkward. Watch him go. Drink it in, man. Various ways to alter the phrase so that it fit with the theme of his promo. Welcome back, man. Ink it in, man. Bring it in, man. He said, "Ink it in, man." Try it on, man. <laughs> Squash him down. Man. Chris Jericho's so fucking funny, bro. Me in, man. You in the face, man. He was marking out, man. Cheer me on, man. Smack it down, man. Say goodbye, man. Drink it in, man. Drink it. Smell it. Taste it. Gift of Jericho, man. Just drinking it in. Number six, <laughs> stupid idiot. Jericho is famous for his ability to get even the simplest things over. Calling someone a stupid idiot might be a more fitting <laughs> insult for the school playground rather than the wrestling ring. Stupid idiots. I didn't call you idiots. I called you stupid idiot. But Jericho's charisma and his delivery of the line was so funny, he just made it work. Exactly. Work That's why I love um, Chris Jericho. He's got so much idiot. charisma, right? Stupid idiot! You disrespectful, stupid idiot. Congratulations, Ambrose, you stupid idiot. You stupid idiot. I heard that. You're supposed to. That's a stupid decision. You're supposed to. That can only be made by a stupid idiot. Number five, filthy, dirty, disgusting, brutal, bottom-feeding trash bag hoe. Jericho saved some of his Damn. most vicious insults for Stephanie McMahon. But there was that one line facts. in particular that summed up exactly how Chris felt about Steph. Stephanie McMahon Helmsley is nothing more than oh, no. a filthy, dirty, disgusting, skanky, brutal, bottom-feeding trash bag hoe. Shut up! Shut up! Number four, best insults. Jericho could go toe to toe with anyone during a promo. Jericho yep. spat bullets on the microphone with his razor sharp wit and always punctual comedic timing. This made it immensely entertaining any time he tears someone down verbally. The only reason anybody bought your book in the first place is they were hoping that you would die at the end of it. <laughs> Happy ending. I would never, ever hit a woman. But you are not. That's the never ever right there. Never and ever. Nobody hits the floor. Ever. It's usually naked with a paying customer. I'm gonna take care of that smelly, greasy. I'm gonna get you too, Rhino. Animal. And I'm gonna get you too, Rhino. Yeah, I love that. I've seen that so many times. How old you were, not how many men you've been with in the last week. The gore and the whore. Shut up. Shut up. The gore. <laughs> From Winnipeg, you idiot. Email, you idiot. Just read it. I can promise you I'll never say anything about your father on this show again. However, 
Your sister? It's almost like your parents got horny while they were watching me beat up Juventud Guerrera 25 years ago, and nine months later, your little twerp ass popped out. I'll even have sex with your mother. Again! Number three, never, ever again. Oh, that's never, actually ever on again. here. First never, ever, in WCW. ever, never, ever, ever happen again. Leading to Jericho bringing it with him to the WWF, where it yeah, finally great. a success. Mm -hmm. It's a phrase the crowd loved to join in with, as Jericho's delayed delivery and unique pronunciation <clears throat> just made it so entertaining. We'll never, e e ever be the same again. Yes. 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 Again. Yes. Again. Yes. Again. We'll never, ever be the same again. Will never, ever be the same again. Number two, Raw is Jericho. Just like I forgot about Raw is Jericho. Became Monday Night Jericho. Welcome to Monday Night Jericho. Welcome to. Monday Night Jericho! It was after joining the WWF in 1999 that Y2J turned yeah. Raw is War into Raw is Jericho. Raw. Welcome to Raw is Jericho! Number one, you just made the list. Jericho holds the distinction of... <laughs> I was wondering if this was going to be on it or not. And writing but... two beloved lists, his iconic list of 1,004 holes would be followed up by the legendary list of Jericho, where those who wronged Jericho ended up being put on the list. From the builder... You just made the, of the, pen, the, the list. <laughs> the, list line, the crowd ate it up every single time. You know what's going to happen? Oh, you know what's happening right now? You know what happens because you put Kevin Owens in this match? You know what's going to happen? You know what happens, Chins McMahon? You know what happens when you touch my personal property, don't you? You know what happens when you <laughs> don't impress Kevin Owens at the Festival of Friendship, huh? You know what happens when you betray Chris Jericho? You just made the list! You just made the list! You just made the list! You know what? You just made the list. Brace face in row 12 is now on the list. AJ Styles? <laughs> Brace face in row 12. You just made the list! You just made the list! I love watching the you just made the list gimmick and just people around them just breaking character, just fucking dying laughing. Like Roman in the background just now and like some other people just laughing, just dying laughing just because Chris is just so fucking funny, bro. He really list. is. The list got a brief spin-off in AEW as the lexicon of Les Champions. And who could forget the list of KO, which featured just one name. How come my name's on this? Oh my god! <laughs> Chris Jericho will live forever. In an industry of Greenbergs, Kirk Angles, and Stone Cold Steve Ass Clowns, Jericho is the only wrestler that can say, I am the best in the world at what I do. Do you understand what I'm saying to you right now? And after all the catchphrases are said and done, mm -hmm. after all bottom feeding trash bag hoes have shut the hell up, all the Jerichoholics have drank in the gift of a little bit of the bubbly, all the episodes of Roy's Jericho have ended, and all the stupid idiots have made the list, we will never, ever forget the Ayatollah of Rock and Roller again. And that brings us to the end yeah. of this video. As that always, if you enjoyed the video, be sure to... Like I said, I love Chris Jericho. Top three. Number three. Uh, yeah, just so good, like, good at wrestling, good on the mic, good at, like, just things that you'll remember over time, right? Just catchphrases, other things. I, he can just bring up later, and just the crowd will know again, right? Just like, oh, I remember that, just crowd jumps in. It's great, but yeah. Anyways, I enjoyed this video. Uh, like I said at the beginning, I think the original link will be in the description down below. And yeah. Thank you guys for watching, if you enjoyed.
do all the stuff, and yeah, goodbye.